Grand Old Partisan celebrates more than 16 decades of Republican heroes and heroics. Today, I commemorate the Washington Naval Armament Conference. Secretary of State Charles Evans Hughes, a former Republican presidential nominee, gaveled it to order on November 12, 1921. Republican Senator William Bora had been its leading proponent. Their goal was to prevent a naval arms race in the wake of World War I. Delegates from nine countries gathered at DAR Constitution Hall, invited by President Warren Harding. The most important agreement reached was the Five-Power Naval Limitation Treaty. Britain, the United States, France, Italy, and Japan limited construction of large warships. Also, many existing battleships were to be scrapped. This treaty was ratified by the GOP-controlled Senate of the 68th Congress. Back to basics for the Republican Party is my civil rights history of the GOP. To quote the book, the more we Republicans know about the history of our party, the more the Democrats will worry about the future of theirs. For more information, see grandoldpartisan.com.